Alright guys, what's up? You already saw the title, How to Change Your Crosshair for both Java and Windows 10 Edition. So uh, yeah, enough talking, let's just get right into this. Um, first thing you want to do is click on your uh, little search bar here, type the search, and you want to do percentage app data percentage and get this file folder right here and you can just click on it or hit enter it'll bring you right there now if you're on java edition what you're going to have to do is click on dot minecraft uh but for me i'm going to show how to do this for windows 10 edition since that's where my content space and all of that but uh java edition is very similar you'll, you'll see once we get um further into how to do this for windows 10. so for windows 10 you want to just click on app data you want to click on local scroll down and click on packages and then right here this, this is gonna be a little hard to find you want to scroll down these uh folders until down here you will see microsoft.minecraft uwp click on this folder and then you will click on local state your games com.mojang obviously only on there and uh resource packs now once you're here and you have all your resource packs you're just gonna click on the one you want to edit you know the crosshair for obviously so for me i'm going to just do purple's default uh they might the folders might look a little bit different uh for the resource packs but they have you know same concept for this then you're gonna click on textures whoops textures and then the gui all right so once you've gotten to the gui right here you're gonna uh right click here on icons and then if you obviously are using a windows 10 computer I, i'm pretty sure every windows 10 computer has this you want to click edit with paint 3d it's going to bring you into paint 3d all right so using your scroll wheel you're just going to uh scroll in as you can see right here is the crosshair you, you have obviously all your other stuff all that blah blah and um what you're gonna want to do so say you want to delete or add something now this is kind of like the classic pvp crosshair so say i, I want to remove these and then add a dot and make it into like a, a more normal crosshair now what i'm going to do is you're going to use you can use the marker tool turn your thickness all the way down to one pixel all right and use this custom color thing and then it'll bring you here as you can see you know, all the custom colors and then you're going to want to click click right here where it's you know the black background click to use that uh I, i'm just just in case the normal black background doesn't work so you're going to want to do that and then they'll automatically save and then since you have on one pixel now right here i want to remove these so all you're going to do is you're going to click and i'm just going to you're going to have to click like two three times because it's not going to fully cover it at all over one click i see you and then it'll have that gray stuff and it'll be all messed up so you're going to click until you see nothing there is there maybe click you know more than three times just to be sure and yeah i'm gonna do that for uh all of these sides okay guys so we are uh done removing those little side things i guess i don't know what to call that uh, again just make sure you, you click it multiple times just so that there's no like little like gray patches left because then that'll mess up the crosshair now say i want to add you know just the, the dot in the middle right because i mean well i mean this is a fine crosshair too but i prefer to have a dot obviously I'm sure like most people do anyway you're going to do that same thing, but the opposite. You are going to use the eyedropper tool with the custom color, and you are going to, bam, click that and replicate this uh, white color. But as you can see, it's like a little gray. It's that it's that custom color that Minecraft uses for their like transparent crosshairs. I guess I'm pretty sure. Um, and then with your marker, you're gonna go right in the middle, bam, and then you got your dot. Now, as you can see, sometimes it'll uh, add, as you see, a little gray area. So if that ever happens and it adds, you know, that little gray area, obviously you don't want that. You'll just, you know, go back here, bam, to your uh, custom colors, same thing. We'll keep it on one pixel, obviously, and then right here, just delete that. And, uh, oh, I might have messed up. Hold up. Okay. But uh, as you see, I, I messed up before and like you have to be, I mean, pretty precise with this you because I, I was a little slightly this way i guess you just want to be right in the middle because then it'll mess up this stuff but uh anyway guys now that was a very see very very easy that's how you uh you know customize your crosser and then what you want to do with your done you can literally just click the x on close button all right and it'll say do you want to save your work you just click save and trust me it'll save like here we'll go back oh whoops uh, as you can see right there I'm not going to edit with Paint 3D, but as you see, the crosshair is different there. 
so you're chilling and then all you literally have to do is x out of that and uh yeah now let's uh go in game so i can show you guys that the crossers change okay guys so now we're hopping into a pvp pack review world and bam look at that works perfectly first time no issues at that as you can see here i will go into uh my uh resource packs and uh there we go purple's default edit the pack that you know i did the uh you know change the crosshair to and uh yeah look at it now it's a you know regular crosshair just like no like messed up specs or anything like there's uh what you call it um no 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 it's just, i don't know i don't know it, it, it works it's the, <laughs> it's the point i'm trying to make you know what i'm saying like like there's nothing wrong with it at all and uh worked first time for me um yeah guys that was the uh quick and easy tutorial on uh how to change a crosshair easy and uh I believe this, you know, if you guys are having any issues, like, I'm very confident this will work on a uh, Java edition as well. Obviously, for sure, it works on Windows 10, but, like, pretty sure it's the exact same way I just did it. Um, if you're having any trouble, because I know, I, I try to make it, you know, basic and not too confusing, but, like, if you're still having any trouble or nothing is, you know, it's not working for you, uh, leave a comment, and I'll try my best to help you guys out. And, uh, yeah, guys, quick, quick, easy way on how to just, you know, change your crosshair to your liking, and, uh, it's been your boy Ziff. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you in the next one.